Hi, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. Welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea. In this reading, we're going to find out what have people been saying about you lately. To book a personal reading with me, all information is in the description box below. And today is the 23rd of May, 2023. Time here in Bali, Indonesia is... What is the time now? 3.16 a.m. Crazy. <laughs> It's so late. This is a collective reading for Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. If you were to finally guided to watch this video, this message is meant for you, even if you're dealing with the same sign. Okay, now let's get reading started. Spirit and angels, please show me for Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. What have people been saying about them lately? A lot of details in this reading may or may not resonate with you from the beginning to the end. Four wands at the bottom of the deck. So I... I slept, I overslept, <laughs> that's why I'm awake at this time, I was sleeping, but um, anyway, two of wands, lovers, ooh, actually, this is quite nice, for some of you, okay, again, a lot of details in this reading, not gonna apply to all of you from the beginning till the end, but if you've, um, how do you say if you're converted some of you you may have recently converted to a different religion or it could just also be an indication of because the higher fire my verse and the temperance right here these two makes me feel like you have changed right whatever whoever you used to be in the past higher fire my verse you no longer are the same person okay it could be due to religion but it may not always mean that it could just be you changing Right, because the higher fun is all belief and all ways of thinking, or all ways of doing things. Um, and you don't, or the old you, you know, who you used to be, what you've, who you've been with for a long time. You're not the same anymore because now it's because now the higher fun is in reverse and the temperance is in the right position. But this is a way better version of you, though. So people have been talking about how. Um, you know, they like the new version of you. You've changed, right? Um, please bear in mind that whoever who, who have been talking about you lately, these people could be anybody, right? Could be your friends, family, co-workers, boss, ex, someone you could be in a relationship with currently if you have anybody. Um, or it could also be people who watch your social media, okay? So two ones, the lovers... Hmm. Yeah, you had two options at one point in time that I feel somebody or some people could be talking about. Maybe maybe this person could be one of your options, okay? This is just for some of you. So this person could be talking about them being one of your options or you could be one of their options. It could be related to love or it could be related to work. Because this is some sort of a partnership too with the lovers. Um, hmm. So this person will be talking about how I need to make a choice, how I need to get to know Page of Swords, which is you, Gemini, Libra, Chris, how I need to get to know air signs better. Because I need to make a choice or a decision in regards to this person. So there's somebody here talking about that, okay? And then we've got the Three of Cups here. Yeah. It's like to celebrate, make a choice, and then choose, and then to celebrate. Some of you, again, you could have been, you could be one of the options, or that you may be trying to choose between this person and somebody else. But the lovers, the temperance, somebody may be speaking lovingly about you, about how they work really, really well with you. In the, in the beginning, maybe they weren't sure, but now they're pretty sure. It could also mean that. Temperance is somebody very patient, very kind. Someone could be talking about how kind you are, how patient you have been towards them or towards 
you know, a situation. Page of Swords, somebody very intelligent. So someone may be talking about how intelligent you are. Um, even though you are, especially for those of you at a younger age, because Page is young. If you're younger or very new in a certain industry or um, certain environment, if you're very new or very young, someone could be talking about how hey, even though you're not that experienced or even though you're very young, uh, you're st you, know, you, you, you have a lot of information. You st you're very intelligent. You know a lot more than others. You know a lot more than people who are older than you are or people who have been in this industry for a long time, right? So, okay. Um, or people who are way more experienced than you are. Have I already said that? But anyway, hangman in reverse. You change somebody's perspectives about you. Okay, the tower. It feels like there could be someone who has been talking about how they thought you were going to be a disaster. They thought you were not going to be able to make it. They thought you would be, you know, someone, someone that they have set their, how do you say, their perception about you they were so sure about their perception about you at one point in time but they now have changed their mind about you now they are more accepting of you through cups somebody could be gossiping or talking it could be someone like a nemesis or somebody who didn't believe in you okay um now starting it could be talking about how they are starting to believe in you but i'm still keeping an eye on them like i still want to see more of Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. That's what I'm seeing. So the pentacles here is in reverse. Right? See? So these pentacles have been hidden in this bush for a while. So someone may have had these, again, perception about you for the longest time. But you change the way they look at you. They ch You change the way um, they see you. Same thing, right? The perception towards you has changed. But the lovers could also indicate somebody who loves you, somebody who finds you to be very attractive. So someone could be talking about how attractive you are, how they want to be with you, or be with you again, or see you again. But then they need to be patient with the temperance here, because something could be coming in between the two of you, right? Let's see more. Six of Cups, somebody has been talking about how they miss you. Five of Wands, High Persistent Lovers. Maybe this is someone you have had a, um, an argument with, drama with in the past. Um, this person has been talking about all the, actually everything. The drama, what had happened between the two of you. And also Six of Cups, how much they miss you. Good and bad, that's what I'm seeing here. How things transpired between the two of you, King of Swords and Reverse. They may have said something about how the things that you have said to them that could have made them feel a certain way, not good, okay? But then there have been some good memories as well. For once, this could be someone you used to live with in the same house at one point in time, could be married to or in a relationship with, could, be a, could be a family, could be anybody, but um, or working under the same building yeah and high persistent reverse can it speaks about secrets as well so this person will be also revealing your secrets mm -hmm. maybe there's something that they've been keeping to themselves for a while in regards to why things have had happened why things have transpired where it could have led to an ending with the ten of swords here okay for once, also very homely energy, very stable energy. Some people could be talking about how stable you are. How maybe some of you have bought a home, uh, moved to a new home, or rent a new place. Could be anything. Some of you could be married as well. If you are getting married uh, or getting engaged, someone could be talking about how devastated they are in regards of this engagement or this marriage. Or if you have moved in with someone, started a new relationship that looks very very um stable like it's gonna that's gonna be it so this person could be telling people that 
you know, Ten of Swords, Five of Wands, how they're so conflicted now, how they're starting to miss you more, now that you have somebody else, that's just for some of you, yeah, if that's the case, and how they wish they could have with the Tower in Reverse, that things didn't happen the way it has happened for the both of you, they're just keeping tabs on you, they do say things like, yeah, they're sad, whatever, but they're happy for you with the Three of Cups here, mm-hmm, that your connection with them started off strong but didn't take off with the Ace of Pentacles and World First. All right, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius is your reading. Sorry, I'm going super slow. Uh, it's just too late and I'm just waking up and a bit tired and not feeling 100% well as well. Um, but anyway, take care. And um, I do live stream these days. I started two live streams. I've done two live streams. So if you want to catch my live stream don't forget to hit on the bell notification button because i usually do it at the last minute <laughs> i decide at the last minute because i i have to be in the mood to do it you know to to read live and to engage and also to go for a long time and if I'm too tired, I can't go on it. I don't feel like it. I won't do it. But, And also, I do personal readings during the live stream. And it's free, absolutely free, but there is a but. <laughs> but I noticed from my past live stream that people were sending me money, my first one. And I was thinking, it's not going to be fair if I don't do their, their personal um, questions, if I don't read for them because they... They sent me money, even though I didn't ask for it for my first live stream. But I felt bad. So so this, this is what I've come to it. This is what I've come to a conclusion. So this is how I'm going to do it. So basically, it's free. Yeah, You can ask any questions. But, but once, if somebody sends me super chat, I will prioritize those questions. So I will bump the questions up, okay? But I'll do the best that I can to do as many free questions that I, as I can. Depends how long I can go on. Because sometimes I get tired. Most times I'll get tired because for those of you who don't do tarot reading, <laughs> you don't know how exhausting it is actually to read. So, but, um, yeah, but anyway, this is it. Take care, and I hope to see you back here again sooner than later. Bye.